What do you guys think about not tipping? Because customer service and stuff. Have you guys heard that argument that's been going around recently? Speaking like, yeah, of well, reservoir well, dogs. Well, I was going to say, like, rid of tipping. more places are asking for tips. Or and charging a tip my, charge. In- my mentality has always been, if you pay before you get your service, you shouldn't be tipping because you tip based sure. on service. Right. Like, if you give me my food and then I pay at the end, then you, know you what tip because you, know you tip, tip based for? on service. But, like, when I'm at the counter and they ask for a tip first, I'm like, you haven't done anything yet. Yeah. I'm still waiting on my that food. Part, I that part feels No. I agree with that part to so much. Sure, like I service. To ensure proper service, prompt, prompt service. Yeah. Oh. Okay, well, I didn't know that. Don't, I'm not I didn't know that either. But like sometimes people, I hate that shit. It'd be like, like okay, so uh, <laughs> they always like this. They can I get this and that? But okay, yeah. So you just want to answer a few questions before you uh before you insert your uh your card, your card or something like that. And it was like tip, and I'm like, yeah, no. They're asking for tip before you pay, before you even insert your card now. And I'm like, I'm like Look, no, you didn't do nothing. I don't yeah. got my food. Why would I and tip you before right. I got my as, food? As I'm someone, no. as someone who has only worked in service um i'm i'm different i'm indifferent about this because i i don't think we should get rid of tipping especially like restaurants and stuff like that like dude we don't make a a great wage and they're not they're literally not gonna give anyone a livable wage so don't get rid of tipping a lot of servers and stuff we live off our tips right the one thing i will say though is don't we we have to understand as servers and i've known this ever since I started working. We have, to, we are more than whatever political political correctness is like in the rest of the world. Sure. That is our job in general, right? So we, we understand that we have to be so on point with our service to get a decent tip and understand the thing that someone else loves the next person hates. Yep. Yeah, it is. It is. It's not a, a, a con, you know, just because you have one way of doing things. You could be like, I love checking up on this table every two minutes. The next table hates when you check up on them because they feel annoyed. Because they feel annoyed, right? Yeah, I do. I feel that way. So you have. So as a good server, you have to balance that, and you have to know. You have to gauge the table. You have to right? be able to, or you have to gauge the customer. Read the room. Yeah. Right. Um, but I'll say this too: don't expect a fucking tip. When when you work, you never expect a tip, and know that the second you give the slightest fucking attitude, your tip's gone. Your tip is gone. Yeah. If you don't get me wrong, I have done this where I am well aware that I'm in a shitty mood. I don't give a fuck about tips today. I'm gonna give everyone. Like, I'll take the, my six ninety nine. I will take my eight dollars an ass. hour. And yeah, yeah, and I will fucking. I'm gonna be rude to everyone because that's what I want to do today. I am well aware that I'm not making shit today. So here's, here's, and here's I will my, do that. I've done my, that before. I, I don't like when they expect a tip. Here's, here's my I point. shouldn't I, expect a tip. As a consumer, I feel like I shouldn't be expected to subsidize your wages. Like, the tip should be extra. Like, the fact that these places where you're, you get tipped, they can pay you less than Understand with that mentality, wage. though? Understand with that mentality? It's like, fuck, it's like if you tip... It's like wait, what, I, have, what, I have some cousins that what do, do you say sorry, I uh, Like he doesn't feel like they have to Like make up for the living wages Yeah that's true I, way, I get but, that but I get, I get that I get but that. also understand That mostly If you're going to like like if you're going to a restaurant, if you're gonna go eat, expect a tip. Like, expect a tip. Don't go to a restaurant and be like, I only have enough for the bill. That's fucked up. Yeah, but it's if like you're going you go in with to that Starbucks mentality, and they're asking also, for a tip. Also, I like. Wait, wait, I can't hear. Oh, sorry. Can't I was gonna say, but yeah, but like when you're going to like Starbucks, Starbucks and yes. they're asking for a tip, or you're sure. going that's, to like. They have the little cup though. That's different. Well, a lot no, of places do it now it's like on the iPad. Yeah, it's on the iPad. And and it's more fucked up. And I like the cup better because they can get their cash tips ASAP. When you do it on the on the iPad split up. They they split it equally, or they you know whatever, and then they tax it. Yep. It, it, it's yep. fucked up. Yeah, it's that's more, that's yeah. different than a restaurant. And then where you're they start served. and then they start yeah. putting it like on your like on your tax form. Like so they make this much guys, more. Blah blah blah. Have, did you guys see that Trey Parker and Matt Stone, the, the South Park guys, yeah. own their own restaurant? Right. Now? And they like there's no tips stuff like that. Yep. Yeah. There's, there's a lot of there's, there's a lot no of those tipping, Michelin and they pay stars. their they pay their workers like thirty dollars an hour. There's yeah. a lot of they pay them a There's a lot of Michelin star restaurants that don't You're not allowed to tip in the restaurant. and that's cool. You know the bill is gonna be like twelve hundred, but like because you know. No, and I. I totally agree with that if you're paying them 30 bucks an yeah. hour. But but uh, but 99.999% of restaurants are not doing that. And you know Minimum what's wage about and tips this. is what makes up the, It was funny. Yeah. My buddy, my oh, sorry. Just real quick. My buddy who I went to rehab with, he lived in Tennessee. And he was a bartender out there. And he works off tips. They make $3.50 an yeah. hour. Yeah. Right? 
and that's that's okay for the bar industry because they make so much tips, right? Like on on whatever, like the honky tonks streets and stuff like that, right? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. um, I don't I don't know what yeah, street it is. It's right. The main one is, okay. but downtown. Yeah, yeah. Um, but I go. Like I used to, when I worked at the bar, dude, I was walking around with like 600 bucks in cash all the time. Like, yeah. and we were kind of similarly comparing our tips yeah. and yeah. we were making the same amount because yeah, but I make so much in tips that I, I don't need that much money. Right. And I go, imagine making $18 an hour on top of that though. Like I can't imagine working for $3 an hour. I, when I started working, it was $8 an hour. Yeah. That's what I, my first job. And like, I remember getting a 50 cent raise thinking I was like, Yep, the greatest fucking raise in the yep. world. Um, but like working for three dollars an hour just because you make six hundred dollars a day in tips, or you like, could, or you could it's potentially, yeah. yeah. But like, bro, I used to, I used to make a shit ton of money in tips. I would make yeah, two, three hundred dollars. I in did tips, too. Right? I was make. I one time I, in a whole month, I made nine hundred in tips when I was working at a golf course. Yeah, and th but think about this, dude. But and maybe this is because we live in the Bay Area, so we realize that nine hundred dollars is barely your rent if yeah. if that or covers maybe uh, a good portion of it, it covers, covers your half of the rent. half half yeah a good half back then it's they should start tipping teachers that's maybe. all i gotta say yeah but you know what i mean no, and so, so like your 18 dollars an hour is going to be your rent that's everything. the tips is what you buy groceries what you maybe if you want to go there, you know, out there, to drink, was, have have a life. Yeah, that's what your tips are for. So you gotta I'll, understand. I'll say this, we under, you, but you understand that mm -hmm. that's how we live. Right. No, I get that. You know, I would I would prefer if instead you guys were simply paid a living wage and tipping was optional. No, that's in a perfect world yeah, for yeah. Sure. sure. Here's the thing. Sure. Here's the thing that there was a uh, um, uh, like a what, what's it called uh, when they they go around and ask hella people a poll whatever. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Like or, a, poll. They, a study. That's a better word. Uh, I forgot poll too. Who, who, who released poll. it? They use the poll to conduct the study. Okay. Go on. Yeah, yeah. And they they talked about how you, if you live in New York uh, or San Francisco, LA. LA as a food server, you can you can make enough on tips to live in that city, which yeah. is like usually hell expensive. Yeah, that's mm -hmm. that's that depends on the place. Also, yeah. also, there's some of those that work a breakfast spot and a dinner spot. No, two different places right. to make and, enough. And if you're working at McDonald's, you're not making. And you're making all shit. Right. Also, remember this: who tells the poll, the study the people, that manager. the managers, oh, and who and what do they do? They jack up those prices. They say that we make so much more yeah. tips than you actually yeah, do. Yeah, it is, and they steal them when you pay. When you, like, some some they, do, some a lot steal. of do, a lot do where yeah. they they distribute, which is also it, it's not fair to the cooks that don't get like that's the part that's kind of because uh, I get the servers are getting paid. You know, well, cooks genuinely or generally get paid a lot more than servers. Yeah. Well, not well, that much more. Like, uh, not they, they not get, a lot. They get, more. They, it's, it's, it is more. It depends where you work. If you work at a, if you work in at a nicer restaurant, you're making a lot but more. But the than. reason why some of these people now like the tips on the credit card because they distribute it amongst the dishwasher and the cook, and then of course the waiters make more of it. But you know what I mean? Like that's yeah. He, he used to get. My first job, I remember, like, some of the servers would be like, oh, I didn't make that much. I'm going to give you, like, $3. I used to walk out with $10 on a Friday night sometimes. Can you believe the voice party has had merch this whole time and we neglected to tell anybody? T-shirts, hoodies, bath mats, wall clocks, throw pillows, even mini skirts. We will throw our logo on absolutely anything. Click the link in the description below and pick you up some voice party merch today.